As of 2023, 12.7% of full-time employees work from home, while 28.2% work a hybrid model. Work from home or hybrid work, both allow for a more flexible schedule, and most of all, you get to have more time to do anything you love. Staying more with your family, or friends, or even with your pets. You name it. But in order to work remotely, you need a way to communicate with your base and access the information you need. Now, there are lots of ways to do that. But for the purposes of this video, we are going to show you one of the safest and easiest ways to work remotely. Today we are introducing AnyViewer. A remote control software that helps you connect remotely to any computer or mobile phone. Also, we will demonstrate its various functionalities. Thank you very much for joining us. Remember to hit that subscribe button. AnyViewer is a free and secure remote control software, developed by Aomi Technology. It provides quick and stable access to remote computers, with high-quality images that make it feel like you're using a local computer. And because security matters today, it provides end-to-end -end encryption by using a strong, 256-bit elliptic curve cryptography algorithm. Thumbs up for any viewer who provided us with a serial number for this video. Let me just show you what this software can do. First, we need to download it. Go to anyviewer.com, and hit the download. Installing this is really fast. Just click install now. That's it. Really fast installation. Upon launching any viewer for the first time, you will get a nice and clean user interface. On the left side you have your device ID and password. You can give this to anyone who needs to connect to your device. On the right side, you can start taking control over another device but you need its ID. I have another device here for this demo. Let me just quickly grab its ID and connect to it. You can use a security code, or send a connection request to your partner. Let's use the security code. The partner accepts the invitation and you are directly connected. Another way to connect is to use an unattended password. Go to settings and click the unattended tab. Turn on the security code and type your unattended password. Use the other tabs to configure various settings, like image quality or device name. This is one way to connect to a remote computer. With any viewer you can connect to mobile devices too. I'm using an Android device for this demo. First, open the Play Store app to download the software. Just look for any viewer and tap on install. Upon launching the app, you will need to log in. Any viewer doesn't work on Android phones without logging in. Type in your username and password then. There are four tabs at the bottom. The device tab which shows your recently contacted devices. Tap on any device for more actions. You can remotely restart or shut down the device. Or, use the quick one-click control. The second tab, is the start tab, which is used to connect to another device from this endpoint. The third tab, is the tab you will use if you want to connect to this device. And last one, is the settings tab. Let's connect from this device to a Windows PC. Go to Start tab and type the remote device ID. Wait a second before the connection and you should connect easily. Now you can remotely control a Windows PC from a mobile phone. Let's try the opposite now. Go to Accept tab on your mobile phone. Type its ID on the computer, and accept the connection on the mobile device. There it is. We have successfully connected to a mobile phone from a Windows PC. Easy enough to use any viewer for remote connections? Let us know in the comments below and hit that subscribe button too. Your subscription helps grow this channel. Once again, thank you so much for joining us today. See you soon.